moved to the United States where a police officer who was filmed choking a black man to death has not been indicted. For an update, we go to our correspondent there, Alexandra Hall. A white police officer in New York has been cleared of all criminal charges by a grand jury in the death of an unarmed black man who died during an attempted arrest in July. 43-year-old Eric Gardner was allegedly selling loose cigarettes when police approached him on the sidewalk, attempted to arrest him, and then took him down, placing him in a chokehold as he repeatedly told them, I can't breathe. A bystander recorded a video of the incident and it later went viral, calling into question President Obama's pledge to donate millions of dollars in the wake of unrest in Ferguson uh, to purchase body cameras for police departments all across the United States. They would be designed to prevent, uh, to clear up further ambiguities in future uh, police altercations. Now on Thursday afternoon, uh, Attorney General uh, Eric Holder announced that the Cleveland police has reportedly engaged in a practice of unnecessary and excessive use of force just weeks after a Cleveland police officer shot and killed a 12 year old boy as he played with a toy gun on a playground. The Justice Department is reportedly uh, continuing with investigations into the the incident in New York and also into the Ferguson Police Department. Reporting in Washington, I'm Alexandra Hall for Telesur.